Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector. It's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing the 2000, the 2023 Ninja Turtles playset for this year. I picked this up just because I don't have a Ninja Turtles playset for my collection in 2023. And I love Ninja Turtles as I grew up with Turtles in 2003. Before we look at the playset itself, we're gonna look at all the play features. We got the, pull the camera back. All the figures you could have for this playset, but I don't have any of them, but the Turtles. Got Bebop, Splinter, Superfly, Killer Croc, and Rocksteady. But I don't have those toys yet. But I have this play set, and you can have a turtle zip line in and across to, to knock down Bebop or Rocksteady. But we're going to show that off in the review, along with the kick butt flipping turtle ladder thing. We'll show that off. But this playset is 20 pieces, three articulated areas of play. So this playset is awesome. I'm just so glad to have one. I would have gotten the 2003 playset, but it's really rare to find it for 100 bucks. The Rising Ninja Turtles playset is really hard to find. 1980s one, really hard to find. Definitely a lot of playsets out there that are really hard to find and really expensive. But when this came out for a hundred bucks and I got this, I was so happy to pick this up. I was delighted to pick this up. So now, we're going to look at the playset itself. We do get a bag of slime, which would have gone down this tube right up here. But it's so messy, I don't like playing with that function much. So it's definitely something I'm not going to be using in this video. You're probably wondering, am I going to do any side videos? Well, that's a big no. Because I'm going on a toy hunt to Ross, either tomorrow or the next day, so you'll be seeing me on a toy hunt. And that's the zipline function. He can, Donatello can go zipline and knock Turtle down. I have some random Turtle on it, because I don't... Want to put any of the good figures on it. We got Donatello on a motorcycle ready to go ram shredder. And I love to have fun as I go rum rum. Fun. Okay. Now we're going to show off the other play feature. Got to move my other figures. We're going to put a figure in front of it under the doors. Like... Sever. So we're going to get Michelangelo. Going to have to go to the back of the playset. And get him holding those handlebars. If I can get it to work on camera. Hopefully. I might have to pull the playset out just a little bit. Come on. Come on. Might be easier without the nunchucks. And now we're ready to show it off. And he goes knocking down the doors and boom. There goes Sever. And Michelangelo knocks him down. That was fun, for sure. We're going to show off the uh, pumping board for Raphael. So we're going to over the tripod, get on the exercise tool, lifting some weights, why not, there I say why not, because Raphael's a muscle builder, here he is with the weight, boom, Ugh. doing some weights here, yeah, and he can go hit 
Sever from 2012. Why not? There I say, why not? Fun play option. I do say so myself. But that's some of the best play options. I can't do the flicking thing this thing can do on camera. Sorry about that. Other play feature is this. We flick up this little viewing window. And we can get Raphael spying for enemies. I can get them both handles. Oh, sorry, I knocked the tr knocked the camera down. Sorry about that. It's gonna do that several times today. And now Raphael can be like, hmm. Razor at 12 o'clock. Razor at 12 o'clock. It's potty time. <laughs> Sorry, that's from the toy commercial. We're gonna get Razor in there and like. And we have four epic play features which we're gonna show off. So we're gonna turn the tripod and Oh, come on, you stupid play feature. Oh. There you go. Uh, and there he goes, falling out of the turtle... Turtle pot. The, uh... Porta potty. And now we can show off the other feature. And go down goes Razor. Down goes the 2012 Batty with these. And yeah, a lot of fun features for this playset. And I'm just so glad to have a TMNT playset this year. And I'm having a lot of fun. Messing around with this playset. Is this playset worth a hundred bucks? I'd say yes. If you don't have an Ninja Turtles playset, you are missing out. And why I love Ninja Turtles is because I grew up with 2003, way before the 19, after the 1980s came to an end. So any turtle figures I could pick up to go on this epic collection is awesome. And I'm so glad to be able to show this off to you. That's all there is to say for this review. If you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it, please make sure to like, please make sure to subscribe, and don't forget to comment. Oh, I look forward to showing you off the side videos tomorrow on what I find at Ross Dressing in the waterfront area. This is my first ever toy hunt to a brand new place. We went to Ollie's, but we've never gone to Ross. So we're going to Ross. Yeah. Next couple days, we'll be going. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out. YouTube land.